now we know that we can program embedded system using different programming language now the question is which programming language to use there are some factors which are important for selection of programming language the first factor is size the memory that program occupies is very important as embedded processors like microcontrollers have very limited amount of rom that is nothing but read only memory the second factor is speed the program must be very fast that is they must run as fast as possible the hardware should not be slowed down due to the slow running software third one is portability the same program can be compiled for different processors fourth one is is of implementation fifth one is of maintenance and the last one is reliability so based on this factors you can select particular programming language for development of embedded system software okay now let's see how we can program embedded system using assembly language this is how we write code in assembly language there is one software called assembler who converts assembly written code into machine code assembly language maps mnemonics words with the binary machine codes that the processor used to code the instructions assembly language seems to be an obvious choice for programming embedded devices however use of pro assembly language is restricted to developing efficient code in term of size and speed also the assembly code lead to higher software development cost and the code portability is not there developing small codes are not much of problem but the large programs become increasingly difficult to manage in assembly language finding good assembly language programmer has also become difficult nowadays hence high level language are preferred for embedded system programming assemblies also use but mainly to implement those portion of code where very high timing accuracy code size efficiency etc are the primary requirements as assembly language program are specific to processor assembly language didn't offer portability across systems to overcome this disadvantage we use high level language such as embedded c before going into the details of embedded c programming language we will first talk about c language programming the c programming language developed by Dennis Ritchie in the late 60s and early 70s C programming is the most popular and widely used programming language The C programming language provides low level memory access using uncomplicated compiler and deliver efficient mapping to the machine instructions The C programming language becomes so popular that it is used in a wide range of applications ranging from embedded system to the supercomputer embedded c programming language which is widely used in development of embedded system is an extension of c programming language the embedded c programming language uses the same syntax and semantic of the c programming language like main function declaration of data types defining variables loops functions statements etc the extension 
in embedded C from the standard C programming language includes input output hardware addressing, fixed point arithmetic operations, and assessing the address spaces. Use of C in embedded system is driven by the following advantages. C is small and reasonably simpler to learn, understand, program and debug. C compilers are available for almost all embedded devices in use today. And there is a large pool of experienced C programmers. Unlike assembly language, C has advantage of processor independence and this is not specific to any particular microprocessor or microcontroller or any system. This makes it convenient for user to develop programs that can run on most of the systems. C combines functionality of assembly language and the features of high level language. C is treated as a middle level computer language or high level assembly language. It is fairly efficient. It supports the access to input output port and provides ease of management of large embedded projects. Compared to assembly language, C code written is more reliable, scalable, and more portability between different platforms. Moreover, programs developed in C are much easier to understand maintain and debug. Compared to other high level language, C offers more flexibility because C is relatively small structured language. It supports low level bitwise data manipulations. Compared to other high level language, C offers more flexibility because C is a relatively small structured language and it supports low level bitwise data manipulations. Object oriented language such as C++ is not option for developing efficient program in resource constrained environment like embedded devices. Virtual functions and exceptions handling of C++ are some specific features that are not efficient in terms of space and speed in embedded system. Sometimes C++ is used only with very few features. Java is another language used for embedded system programming. It primarily finds usage in high-end mobile phones as it offers portability across systems and is also useful for browsing applications. Java program require Java Virtual Machine JVM which consumes a lot of resources, hence it is not used for smaller embedded devices.